Hello YouTube, this is uh, Black Beer Hunter back again uh, to talk about another beer that I ran across today. Um, it's from Boulevard Brewing, the name of the beer is Platt Habit. Um, Platt Habit happens to be a Canadian whiskey, uh, Canadian whiskey barrel aged uh, Imperial Brown Ale. 14% um, ABV, 24 IBUs, which is pretty nice for a brown ale. Um, it was aged 18 months in a 10 year old, uh, Canadian rye whiskey barrel. Um, it's a, it's part of their, uh, limited release series, um, out of Kansas city, Missouri. Um, sounds pretty interesting, right? Um, I, I mean, I have had a few, uh, Imperial brown nails. Uh, this one in particular, uh, is new for them. Um, yeah, I've had a few, um, but it's far in between where you have one that's a uh, barrel age, like I said, whiskey rye barrels, um, 14% ABV. Um, so things can get pretty interesting. Either they can get it extremely right or they can get it extremely wrong. It's kind of hard to go in the middle. Um, when you go that far with, uh, you know, with the beer brown ale in particular, um, so, um, these come in four packs. I don't think they do bombers. Um, pretty nice. Uh, so here it says 13.9% online. They listed at 14. Um, we'll taste and we'll find out. Um, just looking at the, um, at the bottle itself, uh, you know, the most the, the glass is tinted brown, so you can't tell how dark it is. So we'll have to open it and take a look and see what's going on. All right. Ooh, that smells really good. Oh, a lot. Much lighter than I thought. Not that much head either. Whoop. Like a dark amber. Um, like a dark, dark amber color, a khaki head. Um, wow, it's pretty light. A little carbonation action going on here. Hmm. Take a whiff of it and see how it smells. Ooh, a toffee, pecans. It's really sweet and malty. Uh, yeah. Oh wow, this is really interesting. Um, yeah, kind of curious about that. Um, I can't repeat what T'Challa said. I'm not gonna go with Luke either. They just want to drink it. They want to keep it away from me. So um, let's take a taste. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Wow, it's definitely. Mmm. That's tasty. A ton of vanilla. Um, you do get the oak out of it. Um a nice that barrel agent program is really nice. So you get that rye whiskey, some brown sugar. Uh, mm, maybe some caramel. Let me taste that again. Mm, a little chocolate malt. Maybe some syrup. Like candy syrup. Um, kind of like butterscotch on the back end. I mean, it's really good. Uh, I mean... You got untap labeling it at 4.17. Beer Advocate putting it at 4.25. I'm going to be closer to that 4.3, 4.4. I mean, it's really good. And it's not even finished yet. Like, realistically, I would say sit on this for a year or two, three. I mean, 
it's really good and you can tell it's really young and immature but um it's a must get you must get a hold of this it's a it's a really good look uh, i ran across it at one of my favorite spots total wine again uh no 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 um i'm in the dc area so i actually ran across it in riverdale um there's a bottle shop out in riverdale isn't it uh I forgot they call it the Riverdale Town Center or something. Town Center Market. And so, yeah, I happened to stop there. Um, you know, my normal cruise in the aisles. I kind of go through all the aisles at all the different bottle shops. And so, um, yeah, this was uh, actually sitting on the top of the shelf. Um, and um, I was like, hey, uh, you mind if uh, I get that up there? Is that, you know, being safe for someone? It's like, oh, no. You know, they just moved it out of the way because they had um, a ton of uh, other beers that, um, you know, for Black Friday. So they had so they had to shift some inventory. But, yeah, you know, um, uh, I think it was like 16 bucks for a poor pack. Um which is not that bad for this beer. Like you, like I said, you know, in that 14% range, 13.9% range for four pack. How could you go wrong? Um, let's see. Let me take it on the taste. That's really good. Mm. It's really sweet. Um, which, um, uh, the low IBUs, high alcohol percentage, um, yeah, I think it's definitely, it would, it's definitely going to age well, you know, brow aged. Yeah. I, I can't wait. So I'm going to stat, I'm going to go get me another four pack, stash it. Um, I might crack another one in a year. I'll, I'll review it again in a year to see how it tastes. Um, and we can go from there. So, uh, talk to you later, YouTube. Cheers.